Adela Hernandez Gonsmart was the granddaughter of Casimiro Hernandez Sr., who in 1905 founded the Columbia Restaurant in Ybor City, and daughter of Casimiro and Carmen Hernandez, both Cubans of Spanish descent. She was the wife of Cesar Gonsmart, the mother of Casey and Richard Gonsmart, the grandmother to eight grandchildren and great-grandmother to two great-grandchildren. She was born in Tampa in 1920 and passed away in Tampa this past December. She graduated from the Juilliard School of Music in New York in 1944 and became a concert pianist. She went on tour, appearing in concerts all over the United States, including New York City's famous Carnegie Hall. In 1946, she married Cesar Gonsmart, another Tampa native. He was a concert violinist. Adela and Cesar traveled throughout the United States while Cesar performed in famous supper clubs in the 1940s and early 1950s. They returned to Tampa in 1953 when Adela's father, Casimiro, was in failing health. They took over the business of running the Columbia restaurant. Adela was always very community-minded. She served on the organizational board and was instrumental in forming the Tampa Symphony Orchestra, forerunner of today's Florida Symphony Orchestra. She organized the Ballet Folklorico of Ybor City. She was involved with groups like Community Concerts, the Tampa Ballet Sociedad Teatral de Tampa, and the Ybor City Museum. She served three consecutive terms as president of the Ybor City Chamber of Commerce. In 1997, Vista Magazine awarded her their Achievement Award. The award recognized the accomplishments and community contributions of Hispanic women nationwide who had reached the pinnacle in their community. She was one of 13 women from all over the United States selected for the award. Adela was bestowed with many honors throughout her lifetime. A proclamation from the governor and legislature of Florida proclaimed April 19, 1996 as Adela Hernandez Gonsmart Day in Tallahassee. Tampa's Mayor Dick Greco awarded Adela the key to the city of Tampa on her 80th birthday in recognition and appreciation of many years of commitment, tireless efforts, contribution, and dedication to Ybor City and to the city of Tampa at large. Adela Hernandez Gonsmart proved to be a patroness of Ybor City's heritage. She was the queen of Ybor City, a great lady who was loved by all. Tampa's diversity, vibrant cultural influences, and hospitality growth can be traced to the vision and leadership of Adela Hernandez Gonsmart. It gives us great pleasure to express our appreciation.